Hi, welcome to Nightbird Tarot. My name is Brooke, and welcome to your September 2015 Tarot Love Forecast. This reading is for Sagittarius, and Sagittarius, these are general readings for the general public. If you'd like something more in-depth and private for you, you can check out my website, nightbirdtarot.com. And Sagittarius, I haven't done love readings in a long time, so I felt the need to do love readings for September. So I've already laid out the cards for you, and the theme for you for this month may be potentials of gossip. There may also be potentials of someone spying on you for whatever reason. What has come up is the Page of Swords. When I see this card, this can be a real indicator of other people talking, other people kind of using ta ta tactics, if I can get it out, of not necessarily being malicious, but very interested in what's happening in your life. So the message is just be careful who you divulge your deepest, darkest secrets to, especially when it comes to relationships or if you're confiding in someone about your partnership or relationship or marriage or whatever it is. Just be careful about what you put out there online, Facebook, Twitter. Just be careful about how you form your words and how you get your story across because there may be an interest in this in the month of September. Following this, for many of those that are watching it from and coming from the past, is the Nine of Pentacles. This is a real card of being single. This is very much attributed for female Sagittarians of having a period of being on your own or being single. This can also be one of coming from your past, of perhaps thinking about being single again or wanting to get back to that maybe to restart something in your life. So if you've had a period of being on your own or being single, that's being recognized. Now once again, in the present moment, what has come up for you is a card of perhaps other people not respecting you or people trying to do as little as they can in certain situations. And we have the Seven of Swords. I think it's very much attached to this page because it's essentially stating that there's behavior going on that could be basically manipulative or not really helpful in relationships whether you're single or attached and this is someone that perhaps is trying to get away with something this is in the present moment so if you're feeling as if you're being potentially deceived by someone else or potentially you feel you may be deceiving yourself in what you want in relationships, this is being recognized in the present moment. Now going forth in the outcome position is a wonderful card that's recognizing the fact that you have potential to basically manifest or bring about whatever you desire. And the magician has come forward. So in the outcome position for Sagittarius in the month of September, the magician is signifying the fact that if you want to create your reality, it starts with you. So if you're wanting to perhaps leave a situation, if you're wanting to perhaps change behaviors of other people, essentially it's up to you in order to manifest your reality or to attract what you want to bring into your life, especially if the situation has a cause for negativity. So just keep that in mind. So have a great month, Sagittarians. If you'd like to support my channel, you can be a patron. Check out patreon.com at the link below. Have a great month, and I'll talk to you soon.